We're seeing a recent increase in the tough on crime rhetoric that focuses on using punishment to address criminal behavior. However, we know these punitive responses actually don't make society safer, and there are factors that increase the likelihood that someone will engage in criminal behavior, such as environmental exposures, like living in concentrated poverty or being exposed to a violent crime in your neighborhood, as well as mental health problems like post-traumatic stress disorder, substance use disorders, and personality disorders that are much more common among those who engage in criminal behavior than those who do not. So how do we use this science to actually make justice more humane? Well, one key is to remember that all the factors I just mentioned actually are addressable through a variety of interventions. We recently hosted corrections officers in the state of Connecticut in my lab to teach them about the basics of mental health problems and interventions that are associated with those mental health problems that can be quite effective. And it was just such a profound experience because we could see how exposing people to the science and the decades of work that has been done changed how they viewed certain behaviors that they interacted with day to day.